Hello and welcome to another All About Apps edition from the Clever Art Studio. Today we are going to discuss a very hot topic – how to integrate a payment gateway into your app. If you are a shop owner and you want to perform payments, all you need is a payment gateway and a merchant account. In this case, a mobile application. The situation is almost the same. In fact, it's a very important to have this account in both cases, because this is where your money are held and before they will be moved to your actual bank account. With the mobile app, the mechanism of the payment process is as follows. A user chooses some goods in your app. They are moved to a card. This card hooks up with the payment gateway, which performs the same function as POS in a retail store. What's next? The request is sent to a card processor, your payment is approved, the payment information goes from the gateway to merchant account, here it's stored for several days until it's sent to a merchant's bank, your actual one. There are two types of merchant accounts suggested by third-party payment processors – dedicated merchant account and aggregated merchant account. The first type is set up just for your individual and, of course, it's made for additional money. The sum depends on the provider. Having the dedicated merchant account implies more control over your money. But it has a downside. The acquisition process can take a lot of time and you will need to submit an exhausting information about you and your company matters. And then you will need to go through a deep credit check and so on. If you choose the aggregate account, it means that your funds are in one bunch with other mentions money. There is more difference between them. The type it takes to get your money. With a dedicated merchant account, your money will be sent to your acquiring bank in two or three days. With aggregate merchant account, it may take a bit longer. Define the type of products you want to sell, because there are two different scenarios for digital content and physical goods. If you intend to sell digital content, then you will deal with Google Play Store or Apple App Store policies for in-app purchases. These platforms don't allow to involve third-party payments processors when it comes to the selling of digital products or content inside your application. On the other hand, if you are going to sell physical goods, both platforms recommend using mobile payments gateway providers. If you want to convert iOS app to Android or vice versa, subscribe to our channel because this is what our next video is going to be about. Just follow the link in the description below. There are a bunch of mobile payment solutions nowadays. Some of them are widely known, others are fresh and not so popular yet. Let's concentrate on those which are widely spread among e-commerce mobile application developers. PayPal, Braintree, Stripe, Duola and AuthorizeNet. They are all offer their benefits and different conditions of collaboration. However, it's more important and interesting to figure out how to integrate these services to your app. For these purposes, every provider offers a developer SDKs. This includes strong mobile libraries that facilitate your job since the credit card's data are processed by them. It means that you may less afford for implementation. Stripe, for example, offers two options. You can either use their pre-built form component or build your own from scratch. That's good because you have control over UX since you have an opportunity not to use predefined widgets. Using provided mobile libraries, user-sensitive data will be tokenized by provider's site and then redirected to your server, which is also called authenticated environment. After these manipulations, you will be able to charge a card in your authenticated environment and finish the transaction. What's the use of payment gateway then, you can ask? It would be reasonable. The point is that only provider side knows and works with the user's payment data. This transfer of tokenized data from payment gateway provider server to your server is usually carried out by means of API keys. Most providers have them for free on official sites for developers as well as detailed instructions as for how to integrate payment gateways in Android or iOS applications, solutions for other platforms, program code fragments in different languages. More details on how to integrate a payment gateway in your app you will find in our article. Don't miss more useful information, subscribe to our channel, see you next time guys, bye!